channel. Um, I thought I'll do how to put um, a sari on like quite simple and show you how to do it. I'll do like this, um, put this beautiful sari on, it's quite thin and easy. Um, I do find it hard with like anyone tuned to see how I put the sari on me guys. Um, keep watching. First off, you're going to need a pair of heels because without a pair of heels, it's going to look really weird wearing a sari. It doesn't look very flattering. Um, so yeah, any sort of heels that you find comfortable with. Also, you're going to need a petticoat. It's like a skirt. Um, it comes in different colours. Depending on like sari, you can have like whichever colour to go with the sari. But I'm also wearing a blouse um, that comes with the sari and it's a long sleeve. So I usually wear saris for like events, um, going to like weddings, as you know we always have like every single year. Um, so sometimes I wear saris or I wear like dresses. Um, and wearing a sari can be difficult if you're wearing like heavy ones, um, if you don't have time. So make sure you have plenty of time if you are quite new to wearing it. But in this video I'll show you how you can um, literally wear it in a simple way. This is how the sari looks when you open it up. Um, it's a very um, beautiful sari. It's a banareshi material, and yeah, it's quite bright color. You can wear it to like mendis. Um, this sari I wear it like a couple of times to events. Um, it's quite old sari, but I love um, these bright colors. There's like various colors that you can wear. So first up, you're gonna open up the sari and get the end bit of the sari and you're gonna start by tucking that into the side of the uh, petticoat. Literally make sure it's very tight in there, making sure it's all in and then as you go, you spin around, you kind of gather up the sari. And then what I'm gonna do is tuck um, make sure you get a whole piece which is to make the pleat so I'm going to tuck um, that in while it preps me to create um, to drape the other bit of the end of the sari I'm going to um, make a pleat with that end making sure it's all neat and straight and then whip it round to the left hand side of it where you're going to pin it for later it's just basically prepping it for the length so making sure the pleat is quite neat and tidy so that bit that's draped over making sure the length is perfect not looking too short or looking too long and now I'm, I'm gonna use the front bit to do a pleat I realise this bit was too long so I'll make sure you tuck in a bit more. So now I'm going to fold it into a pleat. This bit can be quite tricky so do take your time. I'm using my fingers to fold it so now I'm gonna tuck it right in making sure it's all straight and you just tuck it right in the front making sure it's all tight and that everything is looking straight and even So it should look like this. And now I'm gonna use the draped over bit and bring it all down. I'm going to um, drape it over my shoulder. Making sure the front bit is tucked 
in and all tight. So now I'm going to pin that onto the shoulder so that it doesn't come off and doesn't slide off. So I'm going to use a safety pin, just a medium size, and you basically pin it into your blouse or any straps or any tops that you have underneath. Um, the more layer that you have underneath, you just tuck it in deeper and it will keep it quite strong. And then I'm going to get that bit to drape over my hands. You can wear it like that or you can fold it into a pleat but this is the way I like to wear it and that's how you do it basically. This is how you put on a sari. You can get that bit and tuck it and put a pin where I showed you on the sleeve. And here's the finished look for you guys. So um, you can put on your jewellery, so I popped on some bangles and earrings and some bindi on um, to jazz up your look. You can also put on a necklace if you want, so you can style it how you like. And I paired it off with a clutch bag ready to go to an event. So I matched my clutch um, with the gold colour. You can basically keep it quite simple. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and you learned how I basically put on a sari. So um, yeah, it does take practice so do give it a try if you wanted to. Thank you guys for watching and take care. Goodbye.